What is up, everybody? I'm Mr. Bobbing. Welcome to Neon Tail, a game that is a lot like Jet Set Radio, I think is what that was called. At least that's what it reminds me of. Yo, 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 you must be here for the license, right? That's an old man. How about a little VR training session going through the basics? Uh, yeah. That'd be great. Loading. Cool. Look at her go. She's so fast. Whoa. This is interesting. Trigger to go forward. Left side to skate backwards. Press RT to gain momentum release. RT turn around with... Wait, what? Gain momentum. Release it. Turn around with left thumbstick, then press LT. Okay, I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. So it's go forward, turn around, go forward, go around, backwards. Put yourself perpendicular to your movement to break with style. Yeah, that's not okay. Um, cool. All right, kind of getting it. Music's pretty good. Went over 10 kilometers, press L and R to use fast break. Do I have like a speed thing somewhere? Press X to hit energy spheres. Alright, I don't know what these do, but okay. This is crazy. I like this, though. Like, I really like games like this where they're really, like, colorful. Oh. Oh, God. Make the jump. Oh, well, this is about to get insane. You can aim precisely while grinding, then jump with A. While grinding, you can still use the triggers to adjust your speed. Shit! Can I try it again? Oh, it just kind of spawned me where I fell. That's nice of it. Well. Let's try that again. I didn't jump. I thought I had enough momentum to just kind of make it. I'm not going to make it. Make it, make it, make it. Yeah. Look at me go. You can wall ride on some walls. The angle you jump on will determine how you ride the wall. What does that mean? Oh god. Thank god for a super jump. Press B to use your boost. Boost tanks consumables that you can buy in shop. Good luck with the license, thanks. Whoa, got too close to her butt there for a second. All right. What is this door? It says welcome. But I guess I'm going this way. Whoa, who's this guy? Hello. Very, very tall man. So you're here to get your license, huh? I'll let you pass the test, but first you gotta prove you're not wasting my time. I've hidden a few badges on your way to the proving ground. Collect the badges, find at least five of them, and I'll let you in. All right, there's one up there. Okay. I can see some very annoying already kind of mechanics for this. Like, I don't know, slight platforming seems like it'll be one of them. Okay, so there's 10 badges. Excuse me. Ooh, trying to see things while you're grinding around is gonna be fun too. Let's get back up here. Oh my god. Oh, here's a badge. Okay. Let's see. Oh. Hmm. I 
Let's try this again. There we go. Can I like have a moment to like look around and not grind on things? Okay, there's a badge over there and there's a badge right there. Nope. Nope, there's a badge right here. Alright, so already the worst part about this game is gonna be trying to control my momentum the whole time. How many is that? Four? Shit. Jump! Got it! I like the way it looks, though. Hello, how did you beat me here? Good job, I see you found five badges. You can go in and try your luck at the license, good luck. Oh, uh, if you decide to get all ten badges, I'll give you a reward. Well, fuck your badges. They're really hard to get. What's my character's name? I feel like that's an important. I like her hair thing, though, where it's like a tube of something, and then her hair's just sticking out. Alright, you can do this. I need to collect as many e-specs as I can. Then send all the points in the goal to score. The e spheres can be hit to get many e specs at once. There is a gold tube on each side of the scoreboard. I just need to get 100 points before the time's up. I'm not going to be able to do any of this. None of this is going to work out how I want it to. Forward, please. Forward. All right, guess I'm grinding on this thing now. Dude, like I need like a better way to like really redirect momentum. Come on. Maybe. Maybe, like, a locking on type system thing would be cool. Just for, like... Like, when you're going over a rail, like, you hit... You hit A or something. And it, um... Okay, now I have to fucking get up there. You, like, hit A, and your character kind of, like... Just kind of jumps onto it, as opposed to, like, trying to use your momentum. Like, hit A, and I could latch onto that one. Because then you would act... Then it would, like... I'm never going to be able to get up there. This is going the wrong direction. I fucked up. I failed because I can't do this. Um, because then it would really help you, like, not overshoot things because you have, like, a little too much... Sp yeah. Yeah. It would really help just to, like, I don't know, really just, like, because, like, that right there. Like, I wanted to just want to land on these things, but it's so hard to hit them sometimes. And, like, that little bit of momentum, like, I just overshot it by a little bit. But there's no way to, like, really control where I'm going. But I really like the way this game is. I fucking hate this momentum thing, too. Like, yeah, I get it. It's how it works. But, like... I need, like, a button to break. Not, like... I don't know. I guess you can just kind of reverse. And that'll... I don't know. Maybe I'm just bad at it. Okay, I just kind of did that instead. That's fine. Okay, I have to get going now.
Come on, no, up, up, don't fall down here. I'm never gonna make it now. There's no way, I don't have time. I don't know how to get up there. Oh, that one fucking just kind of takes you to it. Okay, I should do that one next time. I don't know how to get to that one on the right. It's fucking stupid. I don't know how this is going to work. What? Thank God. I did it. Yeah, with like one second left. SFS Pro Games, here I come. Oh my God. I really liked that. That was really, uh, I was really fun. I really, it was really cool. I really like it because like, there was like Jet Set Radio and that was like really the only, that's what that game's called, right? Yeah, Jet Set Radio. It was the game about skating around. And, like, really, it's the only game that's like this that at least I know of. And it's really cool, and I really like the style, and it's really fun, and it, like, flows really well. Obviously, like, the controls could use a little tightening, the whole, maybe, like, the ability to, like, I don't remember how Jet Set Radio worked. I don't, like, remember how tight the controls were. They probably weren't actually that good. It was just that era of games where you were used to that kind of stuff. Um... But I really did enjoy this. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment, and or subscribe. Or don't is up to you. You want to put a purse after all. And I'll see you all later.